Hey, what up there, YouTubers? This is that Windows guy, and I'm here bringing you a video of my top five apps for the Windows 8 slash Windows RT operating system. Now, these apps should run on pretty much any Windows 8 device besides the Windows 8 phone, so they should be good for you if you're running Windows 8. I, these are just suggestions. I'm not saying that if you have a Windows 8 device, you're going to absolutely fall in love with them, but if you have a Windows 8 device, you'll probably use them just as much as I do. Anyways, let's get right in. The first app on our list is the Facebook app. Now, the Facebook app, this is Facebook Touch. There's a ton of Facebook apps out there. Some of them you pay like $2 for and they're crap. Some of them you pay a dollar for. I've hunted down the best. I'm not sure if this is the official Facebook app, but it's a gosh darn good one. Now, Facebook, uh, it, you, as you can see, it has live tile updates. I mean, and then when you open it, it goes straight to your newsfeed so you can creep on all your friends and see exactly what they're doing. Next, th next thing, I mean, like you can update your status, upload a photo, and I don't even know what check in does because I'm not a Facebook person. But it also has who's online right there. I mean, one bad thing about it is that when you do it like this, you get rid of your friends list, but you know, that's that's okay. I mean, it doesn't doesn't affect the app that much you have your toolbar up there if you get um, you have your home button there and then you can remove the ads by buying the official app okay so next thing is the uh, I am plus app and I'm seeing uh, it's loading okay anyways the I am plus app is an app that I use as you can see you can use all these accounts on it but the main thing, I mean, like, I have all my accounts on here that I want. I mean, you can use Facebook, pretty much any social website you can l log in here. Usually when you open it, it loads to this screen, but I had it open earlier, so it loaded that screen. Um, you can see your latest chats, your com contacts, your favorites, and your accounts right on the main screen. And then I'll show you how to add an account right now. You go to Accounts accounts come on there it goes you st come on go away go away go away gotcha you pull that down you add and then it gives you a list of accounts that you can add it does have a live tile update which is really nice an app is never complete without a live tile update so the next one on my list metro tube now MetroTube is really good. I love it. Really good app. Once again, had it open before, so that was this is where it starts. Okay, so as you can see, there's your subscriptions. It has all these uh, popular, then categories. It has these little options. It has that famous Windows 8 side to side um, uh, scrolling feature, which I always find pretty cool going against the grain there windows that's what I like anyways you can click on subscriptions see all your subscription channels there and you can click it shows you all the latest videos right here but if you want to just zero in on let's say I want to know what machinima is up to it shows you all the latest videos of machinima machinima huh. anyways okay so the next one right before the best one is the CNN app now CNN is a great news service um, they usually are pretty honest and the CNN app lets you see all the latest news top stories without even having to really try I mean I'm not a news guy but man like this app makes you want to be a news person and if your friends are talking about oh what uh, that latest story blah 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 you, you don't have to feel like that one tool that doesn't know what that you're talking about right here really good app alright now my favorite app is the Google app surprisingly the only one that is really anti Windows is the Google app <laughs> and 
that is because it's really good at picking up on your voice very clear and um, as you can see it's getting exactly what I'm saying so that's always good anyways um, he also has this little application feature lets you go through all these different things I mean it's a really nice app has a lot in it it's, it, it's by far the best app I think on the Windows Surface RT now pretty much every app that I have on here is a really good app so I mean if you see any good apps that uh, like I obviously probably don't have let me know and I'll definitely give it a try anyways this has been that Windows guy I'd love to hear your comments about the video and please subscribe have a nice day